At a quarter to three is the carded off time for race five, which is the first leg of the first jackpot. 2,400 meters is the distance they'll run over, 2.4 kilometers. A couple of them are a little under sufferance in here, which is going to make it that much more difficult to try and predict the outcome. But in saying that, at this point in time, there are nine runners going to post. I quite like number four, Mrs. Hotline for Peter Musket, Hollywood Syndicate, Donovan Dillon. Has the form to be concerned here in the finish. Number five, Twice Golden, looks to be the one they have to beat. Dropped in the ratings, Anton Marcus rides very good second behind Black Ball in a pinnacle last time. But D's, I don't know if it's as easy as that. And there's a horse that I haven't included in my play. Obviously, there's time to include the horse depending on, on your response. Number two, Dream Destiny. You represent the Dale and Chinsami racing operation. And here's a horse that, as I said, doesn't look to be well in, but I'm not sure we can ignore him. Yeah, I think you're right about it not being the ideal race, Warren, you know, being a merit rated 83 and also having a rating of 64. But uh, the fact is, you know, Com suggests that he's coming in with a low weight, 52 kgs, it's 2,400 meters. You know, he'll be placed at the back of the field, the usual position that he comes from. And with this low weight, although he's taking on some hard knocking uh, horses here that have no stamina doubts as well, a type of horse that could be making steady progress down the lane. So whilst I can't give you much confidence, Warren, what I'm suggesting is trifectas and quartets is one to include. And if you're not convinced in the small field with any other horse, or you looked at it and you're saying it could be a field race, then you know he's a horse that uh, will obviously you know have to be included if you're cutting down from the nine horses, like including four or five runners. Okay, who's your first choice? Who do you think's the horse that they all have to beat? Um, and how do you see it unfolding? I think uh, Twice Golden is the right horse in the race. Uh, Anton Marcus is uh, hoping to catch the right wave at the right time. He knows the horse. He's won once on him. It's one from one. Distance is no problem. Course and distance is four runs for two wins. That's clear to see uh, from his last start. He was a clear second best behind Black Ball. And against this type of field, I think he'll be good enough for the place accumulator, number uh, five, twice golden. A nice rating drop as well now of an 82. But the one runner that I have a lot of respect for, and uh, this horse, I was wanting to make him my top choice, but then you'll see in the place accumulator se uh, uh, segment, possible bankers, I think twice golden looks to be the, the obvious choice, just on what he represents. But sure. a horse that I think is going to improve in a big way over this 2400 meter trip considering his pedigree is the appeal. He's a half brother to Fort Country who got 2200 meters, a seven time winner. Uh, he's related to Paint Your Way, Color Your Dreams, All State 2000 meters. He's got 53 and a half on his back and he's got a jockey that knows him well. So this for me is the unknown in the race. Number seven, the appeal. So my top two selections are five by seven year Warren and then it'll be foolish to discount the chances of the ever consistent, honest individual where you will get a run for your money. Number six, run to Denmark. Okay, so principal numbers for D's there, five, seven, six. I've gone five, four, and I do respect the two for Trifectus and Quartet's Dream Destiny, but I also respect what D says about the appeal and about run to Denmark. D's, you said earlier on, you know, there's nine runners, if you're going to put the four, you know, half of them, four or five, you might as well put the field in the pick six. But I, I, I understand that theory, but I don't know if it's a field race. I'm including three horses. My top three choices, uh, in order of preference, as you've uh, called them out, five, seven and uh, six. Uh, that's going to be my play for jackpots and pick sixes. Place accumulator. Well, banker number five, twice golden. But if that misses and the appeal has to run in the top three, I'll be gutted because I've banked twice golden in the peer. Okay, so that's an assessment of race number five and how we think they're going to run. We'll be back shortly for race six.